Just a real short video clip on fan motors. There are fan motors used for the chaff units, the most important ones of all, and also for the cooling tray. Basically, when you get a fan uh, replacement, if you ever need a fan replacement, you're not going to get it with the extra carbon steel, steel bracket that's custom made. As you can see, there's all different types custom made for each roaster but you're going to get a fan that's basically like this that has a bottom similar to that and you simply just take the screws off of the base of this and take the bracket off of the fan there's all different sizes uh, using a screwdriver in rare cases, to get to the screw, you may have to loosen some hexagonal um, bolts on the old dead fan to get to it, but it should be relatively easy. Uh, that especially applies with the um, cooling tray because they're kind of hard to get to. And then simply put that new bracket on top of this. What you're going to find is there's one more part you're going to need to take off the old fan. And that's because the new fan is going to come with a connection like this. And usually the box in the fan, there's one of these. So it will hook into a, a circular pipe. But if not, you can take the one off your old fan. Uh, you're going to need to use the bolts in either case to put it on that. And then when you're done and you put it all back together, you got the exact same replacement of whatever you uh, took off of the old one to put on the new fan. It's that simple. And uh, as long as the wattage on the motor is the same, you should be fine.